So when I wake up, the first thing I like to do is check my emails. And this morning, I've got one through from Nabil Abdullah. Now Nabil says with the subject being interesting business. Hello, I must thank you for giving me the audience to explain this important issue to you. I've been in search of someone from your country who is capable of handling this transaction. I await for your immediate response. Best regards, Nabil Abdullah. So I said, hello Nabil, I hope you are having a great day and what a pleasure it is to meet you. I'm very interested in this transaction. Please, can you explain some more? Very best regards, Josh Peters. Casper, Nabil, Nabil's replied. So he says, Hello, Mr. Josh Peters. I've been in search of someone from your country with the same surname as yours who is capable of handling this transaction. I am Nabil Abdullah, a bank officer here in the UAE. I believe it is a great opportunity for me to share this vital information to you today, which I know will interest you as you are going to benefit from it. One late Michael Peters, a citizen of your country, has a fixed deposit with my bank valued at 26 million US dollars. Oh Jesus. Sadly, Michael was among the death victims in an earthquake disaster that occurred in the coast of central Chile on Saturday, 27th of February 2010 that killed over 800 people. And I am now seeking your cooperation to present you as next of kin or heir to the account. Since you have the same last name with him, let me know your mind on this and please do treat this information as top secret. We shall go over details once I receive your urgent response. Okay, so I'm going to uh, reply. I'm gonna, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just add a dollar sign to the, uh, to the subject because I think that's quite nice. So now it's interesting business with a dollar sign next to it just so that he knows I mean business. I say, Dear Nabil, thank you for your quick and prompt response. Thank you so much for choosing me to receive 50% of the $26 million. I'm in quite a tough spot for cash currently as YouTube is demonetizing a lot of my videos. So when I heard that you were going to be offering me $53 million, I was very, very, very excited. I think with the new money, I am going to buy myself a Lamborghini, a Ventador and a very big house. What will you do with your $53 million? Would you be available to give me a call to discuss further arrangements? Thank you very much, Josh Peters. The bill has responded! Right, now things are getting exciting. Josh Peters, what is your phone number so we can chat further? So I, of course, responded by adding in another dollar sign to the subject of this email and saying, Nabil, everything sounds perfect. This sounds great. My number is 077 blah, 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 blah. When are you going to call me? I look forward to hearing from you. Thanks, Josh Peters. Now, this was like two hours ago, and I have still yet to hear anything from Nabil. A few hours went by, then a day, then two days, then three days. By this point, I'd pretty much given up hope. But then all of a sudden, just when all the hope seemed lost. Hello? Hello, this is Nabil speaking. Am I talking to Mr. Josh? Ah, oh, Nabil, yes, how's it going? I'm fine, very well, thank you. I'm so sorry to hear about your friend, by the way. Did you say his name was Michael? Yes. Yeah, thank that's... you very much. How much money are we talking here? The amount is uh, 6 million plus. Oh my god. <sighs> um, sorry, this is so exciting. So I get 26 million dollars if I do this? Okay, so I get fifty-two. So I get fifty-two million. Yes. Okay, great. Right now, I'm still at uh, like. That's true. So it's it's hay hay fever. You need to send me information which I requested for. What the fuck? Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, but. I've got a pet alligator and it makes noises. What's that, bitch? Do I send you over what? The information? Send the information by email. Okay, and what exactly is that information? Again? Your name, your full name, date of birth, address, and telephone number, and also your occupation. Oh, shit. We might have a bit of a problem because if you need my occupation, I'm, I'm unemployed at the moment, unfortunately. No, no, no. I need an occupation. Uh, maybe you could give me an occupation or something? <laughs> I don't give you an occupation. Oh, it's just you, you laugh. I used to clean the lime scale out of the seal of showers. Okay. What are you going to do with your half of the money? No, it's my business. I want to use it to 
What are you gonna do with it? Should I find him back? Wait. I think you scared him. I think it was long enough anyway. Yeah. Cause it. Ha Hello. Sorry, sorry. Um. I, I've got a child and you know, I just got really annoyed with him. I just shouted him. I'm sorry, I wasn't shouting at you. I thought the line was going back, so. Yeah. What are you wearing? Sorry? What are you wearing? What do you mean by that? I get super excited about these kind of things. I'm wearing, I'm wearing suit, I tie, and shoes. God, that's nice. What color are the shoes? What color are the shoes? Uh, okay. I think you are moving away from what we are discussing, okay? Uh, no, 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 we'll get back there, we'll get back there. What color are the shoes? We'll get, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna, okay, okay, I'm sorry, I, I digress. <laughs> <laughs> Call them again. What should I say? This is an FBI investigation. <laughs> Nabi Nabil Abdullah, can you confirm that this is Nabil Abdullah speaking? <laughs> <laughs> and that was the last I ever heard from Nabil. I tried calling him, I tried emailing him, there was nothing. Uh, he went cold. So that brings the video to an end, but I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, please subscribe and like the video, and I'll see you soon for another one.